and welcome to another edition of Fashion Tech Friday. You're watching Electric Runway's YouTube channel where fashion meets technology. I'm your host, journalist and entrepreneur Amanda Costco. Thank you so much for tuning in. So we've heard so much about augmented reality these past few years, but so many brands and retailers are still struggling to understand what this technology means for their business. So in today's episode, we are looking at three AR stories making headlines this week. Let's get right into it. Fast fashion retailer Zara announced that on April 18th, they're going to be rolling out an augmented reality experience across its flagship stores. Customers shopping at 121 Zara locations globally will be able to view models wearing Zara clothes on their mobile phones in real time and shop the looks. The technology will also enable models to pop up on packages of online purchases delivered to customers showing alternative outfits. So as more and more competition arises online competing for your shopping dollar, companies like Zara know that they have to keep up and augmented reality seems to be the missing link for mobile focused customers. Second up, we are looking at the New York Times use of augmented reality to report on David Bowie's costumes. The culture design and graphics team at the Times have put together an AR experience that allows viewers to get up close and personal with some of the performer's legendary outfits. When the article is viewed through the Times smartphone app, readers are able to place and examine costumes up close, including Bowie's Tokyo Pop jumpsuit as well as his lightning bolt suit. And while the Times isn't creating this content to sell the garments, it should inspire fashion companies to consider the possibilities augmented reality can provide for bringing looks to life for audiences across time and space. So if you're interested in viewing this AR experience for yourself, we'll put the link to the Times article in the description below as well as on Electric Runway. And finally, our last story of the day, Toronto-based Modiface has been acquired by L'Oreal for an undisclosed amount. For those who've been following Electric Runway, you've definitely heard of Modiface before. It's the company that installs AR features into the apps and mirrors of leading beauty brands to let consumers visualize makeup and hairstyles in real time. The French cosmetics company will now have a competitive edge when it comes to technology, which may help the brand stay relevant amidst growing competition. What do you think and what did I miss? Let me know in the comments section below. As always, if you like this video, don't forget to hit that red subscribe button and that thumbs up button. I would appreciate it so much. For daily fashion tech freshness, we invite you to follow us on Twitter and Instagram. We're electric underscore runway. And you can always check out what's happening at electricrunway.com. Thanks so much for tuning in. We'll see you next time.